Students at this Albuquerque ITT Tech location expected to get back to class after the Labor Day weekend. This note on the door even said we will return Wednesday, September 7th. But that wasn't the case because every single one of ITT's U.S. campuses closed for good on Tuesday. I'm appalled that they shut their doors. New Mexico Attorney General Hector Baldera says that leaves nearly 400 New Mexico students in the lurch and many thousands more nationwide. Some took out federal loans to pay ITT and now they don't know how they'll recover. Many times students um, are struggling to pay back these loans. Many times these students are of low income, students of color. Uh, who really can um, be protected. So today, Baldera sent this letter to the U.S. Department of Education, stressing that the federal government, in part, failed these students and needs to make it right. I believe that they need to step in and assist in forgiving loans. They need to set up transition costs. Balderas also wants to make sure this doesn't happen again. Right now, he's in the middle of a long-running lawsuit against ITT and says in the end, students weren't the only ones who lost out. Taxpayers are paying for these student loans, and they deserve simply a better product in terms of higher education. And says taxpayers should demand more of higher education. Well, their office did tell me they want to hear from you if you went to ITT Tech here in New Mexico because you're likely eligible for different services that could help. Back to you.